Yo, what's up, people? Strategist418 checking in with another video. Sorry, no webcam today. I uh, don't feel like being on cam today, so you're gonna have to just look at my uh, my computer, my computer screen without the face. So, uh, hope you guys don't mind that too much. But basically, today it came out for PC gamers like myself um, and many of you who probably watch my channel who are also PC gamers uh, anybody who's a PC gamer basically um, it's pretty much good news today for people who are who are fans of PlayStation's games and shit like that today Sony has came out and said that they have acquired Nixes. So if anybody knows who Nixes is, they're basically the company that's behind porting a lot of games to PC. So I'm pretty sure they do the Tomb Raider games, like, um, you know, Tomb Raider, uh, I believe they did Tomb Raider 2013. They did all the Tomb Raider Survivor games. I think they also did some older games like Legacy of Kane and shit like that. What I've been seeing on, um, on Twitter. So basically, essentially, they are a PC port studio and they worked on Rise of the Tomb Raider and to put that on PC, I believe. And they also worked on 2013 because I remember when I played 2013, they their name came up. Um, and same thing with uh, Shadow of the Tomb Raider as well. They also worked on that. So basically, this is a PC port studio. So again, for you guys who don't know that, that means basically they put games on PC. So like developers like uh, port studios like Iron Galaxy, uh, uh, pe people like, um, you know, people like Iron Galaxy, people like, uh, what was that other one? Fuck, there was another one that they had. Uh, don't remember the name of it. Uh, anyway, point is, is that, yeah, PC Port Studio. So this means that more games are going to come to PC. Uh, yep, that's what that means, because why else would they buy a PC Port Studio who specializes in PC ports? Uh, you know, come on. Like, there's not even speculation at this point. So PlayStation Studios appears to be stepping up its Windows PC porting efforts thanks to a new addition to the PlayStation family. Head of PlayStation Studios, Herman Hulse, announced Thursday that Sony today that Sony has acquired Nixus Software. Or yeah, Nixus? Nixus, yes, Nixus Software. I, I thought it was Nixies, but that was sound too like weird, so I'm pretty sure it's Nixus. A technical developer based in the Netherlands, which is where Herman Hulse is from, I believe, who credits in whose credits include PC ports and op optimization for games like Marvel's Avengers, Deus Ex Mankind Divided, and the modern Tomb Raider trilogy. So, like I told you guys, they worked on that. Um, in other words, it sounds like PlayStation Studio Studios gain is Square Enix's loss. So this is funny, Square Enix actually um, Always, they, I guess they always had these guys working on PC versions of the games. And I've played PC versions of a lot of those, these games that they mentioned. I played Mankind Divided is pretty fucking, pretty fucking um, demanding though. But it, it still looks really fucking good. And there's a lot of features in it. Uh, say with Marvel Avengers, it looks great on PC. A lot of features. Like these guys are really good at porting games. They're really good at porting games, man. So... Um, they do really good PC versions, so I, I can't understand why Sony would acquire them for doing more PC shit. Anyway, I highly respect Nixus, Nixus, and excited. Okay, I highly respect Nixus, and I am, I am excited for this very experienced team to become a part of the world class development community at Sony, Sony Interactive Entertainment. Hulse said in their news release, they have a passion for improving games, for delivering the best possible experience for gamers. This is, will be a strong asset for everyone across PlayStation Studios, helping our teams focus on their important, most important goal, which is to create unique PlayStation content at the best possible quality. 
Um, Jurgen Katzman, founder and senior director of development at Nixis, added that the studios decided to bring a technical and development expertise to IP powerhouse like PlayStation Studios. Sony Interactive Entertainment has been expanded to PC in recent years, bringing previous previously PlayStation exclusive games like Horizon and Days Gone to Windows. Um, PC versions of Charter 4, which is basically confirmed, and Ghost of Tsushima, which is kind of like hinted because they took up the only on PlayStation, like I told you guys in the other uh, thing, are also reported in the works, though Sony has yet to officially announce them. The addition of Nixon software to PlayStation Studio News of Returnal, news of follows news of Returnal and Resogun developer House Marks recent acquisition so basically and we're not gonna i don't care about comments <laughs> not to read them on a obviously on the stream oh well not stream but the video so basically what this means is that sony is going to be porting games to pc at a higher volume because why else would they buy nixus nixus basically doesn't really develop games they're a porting studio like q -Lock. that was the one i was thinking of q lock q -Lock did um the dark souls remastered q -Lock also did um uh, i believe they also did yakuza the yakuza games all the yakuza games q -Lock did um they did also a lot of some of the other stuff uh but they're basically a porting studio so they port games from consoles to pc and actually do proper ports um so sony it makes sense for them to acquire this company because obviously that means that they're going to be putting games on PC at a higher volume and it's going to be faster if they just have Nixus who's a dedicated PC uh, PC developer, PC port developer um, and they know about the PC and all this other kind of stuff so it makes sense so yeah man <clears throat> so peace for PC gamers like me who are interested in PlayStation games I'm not the hugest PlayStation first party person, but there are certain PlayStation first party games that I do like, and uh, I would like to see those on PC just because, you know, it's, it's, it just preserves the games for future generations, and um, it's just cool seeing it on PC, better graphics, you know, if, if it's a certain game like Kip Zone, it would benefit from a better control scheme. Same thing with Uncharted, just mouse and keyboard would just be better for these games rather than uh fucking you know controller pad or whatever so you know better graphics and more features and stuff is also nice as well uh so yeah man nixus playstation yes it's happening they have come together and they are a thing now so that means more ps pc games i mean more playstation games will be coming to pc at a faster rate just because of this so expect to see some PC games or some console or some PlayStation games <laughs> coming out on PC very, 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 very soon. Um, I don't know about Ghost of Tsushima and Charter 4, definitely. I'm pretty sure this is probably what that's for. Uh, who knows? Might just be Naughty Dog. I think Naughty Dog honestly would be just doing a Charter 4. But anyway, I'm rambling. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video and got some informative news from this and yeah, hope to see you guys next time. Peace out.